this is the energy vibration reading for the scorpion sun moon and rising i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back this is um, um the second period i want to say thank you for your likes, shares and support um this is the second period of the year 2018 and in this period we're going to have a wonderful wonderful energy because the energy of the spirit is the energy of the chariot and it is also your focus in the spirit so it's a very successful outcomes in the spirit so whatever is happening with you Scorpius there is going to be a very successful outcome you have the star in April and in May you have the energy of the lovers but in June you have the energy of judgment so you have fire here water twice okay so we are going to be looking um to see what is happening for you cancers because the star and the love is supposed to be very good but when you have judgment coming out that mean it wasn't that good it was just on false pretense so let's see what is happening with a star and the lovers so you have the nine of cups with the stars and the lovers happy 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 in april and may let's see what is happening in june let's see what is happening in june you have the queen of wands the queen of wands um keep on coming up um for you fire signs so it's as if you fire signs are having relationship and 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 actually in the same position so um some of you will be having a relationship with somebody someone who is an aries Lee or a sagittarius and uh, this is actually going to be good and then we have the energy of the two of cups so it is and um, here you're seeing that it is just the energy of the of love coming in um, in um, this period so um, this is going to be good because what is happening as you can see the energy of the lovers um, the nine of cups the queen of wands which is going to be positive and two people connecting together so this could be um, this is a period of people meeting their soulmate and twin flame in the month of May okay remember that your soulmate and twin flame in the month of May a lot of you are going to be connecting with the fire sign people um, a happy um, situation is going to be uh, the nine of cups which happiness your wishes and dreams are coming out with a fire sign person so some of you will be connecting um, with an uh, Aries Leo or Sagittarius and your wishes and dreams are going to come um, out this is going to be a wonderful relationship this um, period is all about relationship for you guys it's all about love it's all about the connection so let's see what is happening with a star and the lovers what is happening for the star and the lovers um, the energy of the star of the lovers is um, the six of swords uh, you know you're you're beginning a new um, a passage in your life with um, the energy of love it's as if you're you've been ill and you now you're opening up your heart what is it with the lovers and uh, and justice you have with the lovers and judge and, and judgment um, the king of ones whoever this king of ones is um, a lot of you are dealing with this king of ones whoever this king of ones is a lot of you there's going to be a judgment coming out for him then you have a strong foundation um, with a star and a nine of cups you have a strong foundation star nine of cups and the lovers there is a very strong foundation what you're dealing with with the lovers and the queen of ones and judgment you're seeing a situation for what it is you're seeing that who's to ever these because you have the king of ones and the queen of ones and there is just good there's going to be a judgment called so if you are both coupled up in a relationship with these people there is going to be a judgment call for the king and queen so let me see what is going to be the outcome for the two of cups cruelty cruelty in the reverse 
form cruelty in the reverse form let's say what this cruelty because actually you have the energy of the two of cups so what is this cruelty all about five of wands um, someone who's a prince of pentacles and the devil okay um, there was a cruelty there was a situation that happened of conflicts is over but this conflicts was caused by someone who's a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and this person plays the devil avocat okay that person plays the devil avocat um, now as I'm looking at your reading first we look uh, I'm, I'm going to look at this, the energy of the star the nine of cups the energy of the star and the nine of cups is it's all about your wishes and dreams coming out for a soulmate relationship that you have been looking for for a very long time and you have met someone who is of a past life and this person is an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius but there is going to be a judgment call that comes out because um, whoever this person is um, you're gonna you're not seeing something completely clear about this this person um, because um, some of you are dealing with um, someone over the age of 40 a man that is an uh, Aries a Leo or a Sagittarian and it has to do with something with love so it's as if this person was in love with you and you're not seeing this and you feel as if you've been um, work against but actually this person really cares about you um, with this judgment call you're not seeing something clearly and you felt as if a sort of a form of cruelty and this cruelty came in that the Prince of Pentacles someone who is and I'm, 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 I'm have this feeling that is a is a Virgo person this Virgo person um, work with the king of the, the it, so this is an Aries this Virgo person work with the Aries to bring a situation to um, block a situation to and, and and that sort of a thing and whoever this Virgo person or this Aries person is because um, receiving Virgo and Aries it could be a Taurus or a Capricorn and but the Capricorn person is kind of looking from the outside in as a savvy sour person so whatever that has happened whatever that has transpired you have to understand that um, a lot of situation um, has taken place and you know it's, it's it, you're coming to an end because um, whatever has transpired this king this person was a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn no it is an Aries Leo sorry or a Sagittarius mm -mm -mm. there's a judgment call that is coming in for him and it's not going to be nice Mm -mm -mm. nope it's not going to be nice you need to find a divine masculine within you in this period you need to find a divine masculine find a divine masculine with you with you in this period wherever you are out there you you're going to need to find a divine masculine because I'm seeing the energy of the star you know your wishes and dreams are coming out you have a very strong foundation you want to leave this situation behind you know you're coupling up with um, your partner who is uh, someone who is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and you feel good about this love is so wonderful because love is coming in from out the fire sign but there is this going to be a, a judgment call because of the energy of this um, king 
and this king is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius so find the divine um, uh, find the divine energies within you because you really 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 going to need to have this um, at this time you're working with Neptune Neptune the planet of Neptune so I attune to the wisdom Atlantis and the Lemurian held in Neptune I attune to the wisdom of Atlantis and Lemuria held in Neptune okay so this is what you're going to be working with the planet of Neptune and call upon um, the guides and angels for a little bit of help because this is what you're going to be needing because you need to see a situation that is going on with the king of the king of ones because this king of one there's going to be a judgment call that is going to come for him that is not going to be nice but it's not your situation keep out of it okay um there is someone who is the prince of pentacles it's not really a nice person okay let's look at the career for the women over 40 love and career for the women over 40 let's see what is coming out regrets women over 40 have regrets six of ones you want to leave a situation behind and you are trying to find your inner light okay so for a lot of you scorpion women out there you have a lot of regrets and you want to leave a situation behind and find yourself and it's better for you to do that it's better for you to do that let's look at the men over 40 what is happening for the men over 40 scorpion is a karmatic situation and you're walking away from it which is good and you have the nine of tentacles so you have money um, so you were going through a karmatic situation you men over 40 um, you're going to be going through this karmatic situation in the second quarter and you're going to be moving away on a new part and this new part is going to bring money so if you are looking for a new um, work and that sort of a thing um, you're going to find it and this is going to bring you a lot of financial um, stability in your life which is going to be wonderful and it's going to be good so um, in work it's all about work for you men in this period and you're going to find financial stability what you wanted and what you were looking for let's look at the people between the ages of 18 and 40 to see what is going to happen for you Pisces um, again you have the number nine and the nine of cups so your wishes for the young people between the ages of 18 and 40 your wishes and dreams are going to be coming out and the energy of the Sun which is so beautiful so that's is good and you have you're going to be working very hard in your relationship some of you are going to be connecting with your twin flame and soulmate which is very good and you are going to be feeling happy both in work and your career life so that is a wonderful thing for you Scorpius and this is for the Scorpius aging 18 until 18 to 40 so I want to thank you for being here I want to thank you um, for supporting my channel please like please like share these videos go listen to the general readings and also um, the um, message from your sun moon and rising sign because this is going to be good namaste until next week